Hello YouTubers, subscribers, friends, welcome to my channel. Mark Twain did say bet best, it's easier to fool people than to convince them that they have been fooled. I want to talk about this uh, Swiss physicist, Auguste Picard. Almost, it says here, nearly 80 years ago, on 27 May 1931, he was the first scientist, physicist, to ever take a high altitude balloon to the stratosphere back in 1931 why doesn't why, why don't they teach you about this guy in school he got all the way to the stratosphere is 10 miles up uh, 51,775 feet and he looked out his little porthole window and this is what he said it seemed a flat disk with upturned edges. He's the first man to reach the stratosphere, yet they don't teach you about him in uh, in school history. It seemed a flat disk with upturned edges. Why is that? Eighty years now, not even they don't even mention him in uh, um, NASA, but they did take his name because his last name's Picard. It says right here they used his name in the the TV series and movies uh, Star Trek, but even Hennessy, the whiskey or rum or whatever that is, they got a commercial out dedicated to him, and it says right here, a toast to the flat Earth community. Why is it such a big secret? Why is it the government won't allow anybody go to the uh, Antarctica? Why is it when people you tell people about this guy, the first guy to ever reach the stratosphere in, in the history of mankind, that he saw what the earth truly looks like. I mean, this is freaking a long time ago. This is way, way before uh, NASA ever went to so-called, uh, parentheses, air quotations in the air, uh, space. They went, what, 1969, they supposedly went to the moon, supposedly? I don't think so. But why don't they? I don't they talk about this professor Augusti Picard. He's a very intelligent guy. I don't get it. All I'm saying is, eighty, nearly eighty years ago, the Swiss physicist Augusti Picard took off from Augsburg, Germany, in a pressurized aluminum capsule attached to a large hydrogen balloon. His destination was the stratosphere, the second ma major level. A layer of our atmosphere between 6 and 31 miles above Earth. No one had ever been that high before and Picard wanted to measure the activities of cosmic rays and investigate Einstein's theory of relativity. He, is, he and his assistant Paul Kipfer reached a record of 15,785 miles, around 9.8 miles. But they don't teach you that in school. I've never heard of this guy before in my whole life. I'm 52 years old. All the years I've been in school, not one time did they ever talk about this guy. Ever. And and they don't even say, the Gene Roddenberry doesn't even say where he got the name Picard, even though it says here that they used his name in Star Trek, the movies and the TV shows. All I'm asking is, that you do this research yourself. Why is Hennessy making a toast to this guy and to the Flat Earth community? I'll put a link to this this is a video, Professor Picard and his Flat Earth Discovery, in the description box below to where you can watch this whole uh, video about this uh, Auguste Picard. You'll see the commercial, and you'll see that he, he's the first man in uh, history to ever reach the highest um, plateaus on, on Earth, and his son is the first man in history to ever go the deepest in the oceans. And uh, all I'm saying is to research this stuff. If you don't like this kind of stuff, don't watch this video. You know, you don't need to put your negative attacks in my comments, you know, and, and, and say negative things. If this is not something that you like to watch or hear, then change the channel. Like Howard Stern would say, change the dial. You know, all I'm saying is, it's easier to fool people than to convince them that they have been fooled. Why, why would they say something like this back in history? Because they know something. The secrets are out there. You just got to look for them. Alright, well that's my video today. Like I said, I'll put a link uh, to this website 
in the description below and I'll put a link to the video. You can watch it yourself, come up with your own conclusions, do your own research. Thanks for uh, taking the time to watch my videos. Like, comment, subscribe. It don't cost anything. It's free. And I'm gone. Get, get gone.